And Lucy, here's Rosie! And me. <laughs> Are we doing this again? Is that what we're doing with our lives? I guess. Anyway, we're playing Pokemon today. Wow! We're gonna, we're gonna go into the Lavender Tower, because that's where we need to go for the story. It's time to bust some Mons. I remember to put my, uh, my, my cool realistic hat on this time, so... Hope y'all appreciate that. Man, I don't remember this part of the game at all. <laughs> Came to pray for Michael Fairy. Sniff, I can't stop crying. Whoa. What did, what did he do? The Why did he hate you so much? <laughs> Are you allergic to Clefairy? Uh, do you have the guide? Uh, yeah, it's over there. Oh, okay. But I don't think I'll need it in here, do I? Probably not. See? That, that, that guy had allergies, because even this lady's like, bless you. <laughs> Man. It's it's so freaking weird that it's just like, yeah, Pokemon freaking die. Gen 1 was wild. Uh, oh yeah, we're gonna put Corona in the lead here. Uh, I'm gonna... <clears throat> I, I've made it. Oh, it's, uh, it's Bloody. He's over there. I, I'm, I, I've said lately that I want to make an effort to not swear as much. Um, but I end up doing it anyway, like, all the time. Just because, like, I'm so used to using, you know, certain words a lot. So I think what I'm going to do is, if I do swear, I'm going to, like, try to come up with an alternative as I do it. And I will know that for the future. It's kind of weird that he's just, like, looking around like he's just, like, a regular trainer instead of, like, Popping up. <laughs> what is he doing here? He's just there to, you know, be a Pokemon trainer. He's just there laughing at the dead Pokemon. Like, the, there's that whole thing about, like, oh, maybe his Raticate died, but, like, even in Japanese, like, he's being an asshole to you right now, so I feel like if he did have a dead Pokemon, he'd be a little more respectful. Instead of being like, your Pokemon don't look dead. I can fix that. Blue, what the hell are you doing? Even this guy doesn't know that Whirlwind doesn't actually, like, do anything in a fight. Oh, we're doing this, this crap all out. Not gonna use Pikachu? Uh, well, I had Corona in the lead and I figured I'd give it a shot, but... I could switch to Pika. It'd probably make this a lot faster. So much bigger now that it <laughs> yeah. like decided. No, fuck you! I'm evolving, bitch. So I see you haven't decided not to swear on stream. Oh well, <laughs> I guess I fucking haven't. I know I, I I will be better. I mean, you can do whatever you want, but damn straight. I just thought that was a bit of a dad joke thing to do to be like to illustrate your your swearingness by swearing. Oh god. What? Fuck off! <laughs> oh god damn it! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so that was uh that was that was a bit of horse hockey right there. <laughs> Let me just wrestle this this big a bag of dragon. What a bag of dongs. I see. Power bombing him. Yeah, I mean, if it works, it works. Uh, Growlithe. Uh, yes, we will have Aqua take care of this one. Ha! My Growlithe's a higher level! You haven't been doing your due diligence, have you, Blooty? We really should not be having this Pokemon fight here, like... No, this is in poor taste. Like, if it, was, if it wasn't for, like, the weird rule in the Pokemon world where it's like, Hmm, you have Pokemon, I have Pokemon, we made eye contact, fight! No matter what! <laughs> like, could you really not just be like, You know, maybe... Maybe we should take this outside. 
Yeah, this is in poor taste. What's wrong with you, honey? I'm not. I'm forced <laughs> into this. I don't have a choice. <laughs> Teleports out. Wait, no, not this here. Guy, Teleports. This guy doesn't out. understand his own Pokemon's move sets. Like, I, I, I understand that one. It's just like some schoolgirl. Like, use Whirlwind. Oh. I thought that was a real move, but this guy, you'd think he would know better, right? Like, Quick, use teleport, and then it just teleports outside the building, like, on the same floor, so it's just like, Is withdraw something I need? That just, like, boosts defense, right? Um... Yeah, I think. Um... Well, I, ha I have bubble and water gun. I don't know, like, like, water gun's better, I think. I don't know if bubble has any sort of, like, usage. Mm -hmm. I don't know. So this is why we need the Poke experts around to help us. Does this thing have a move list in it? It should, maybe. I don't know. I mean, it, no, I know it lists like what moves he get, but like, does it see what these moves actually do? Because I don't think the game itself even freaking says in Gen One, does it? If it does, I haven't found it. I mean, this is all about like the. the <laughs> the trading card game in Pokemon Stadium and all that? <laughs> Sh should I have, like, added everyone a second time in my, my Discord? Yeah, sure. Let them know where we're going. Because I really don't know. Like, I've never been, like, a defensive player in anything. So, when it's, like, you have four moves, I, like, really don't know, like, what should I do. Especially because, like, you can't, like... You can't, like, get old moves back in Gen 1, can you? You don't have, like, the move tutor. Uh, hang on. Uh, Spurtle's side special. It's oh. a water-type move? What the hell? Hang on. I'm a war turtle by now, just so you know. Yeah, hang on. Tell me what it does, god damn it. Let's see, put your your Pokemon card back on the bench. Tell me what it... Oh, it's a non-damaging water type move. Okay, so yeah, just both buffs defense, I'd say me. Uh, do I have, like, something like... Yeah, I could get rid of, like, Tail Whip or something. Or, yeah, like, yeah, get rid of Tail Whip, I'd maybe, say. Maybe, like, I, I still don't know if, like, Bubble has any, like, point when I have a Water Gun. Mm-hmm. Could you, like, look at that? Uh, Bubble? Bubble and Water Gun. Make sure you look at, like, the Gen 1 stats for those moves, too, because that, that stuff changes. I'm attempting to. <laughs> Sorry to make you be the Pokemon Professor right now. You're my Pokedex. Yep. That's what it is. Oh. Uh, uh, Bubbles powers 20, has a 33.2% chance of lowering the target's speed stat by one stage. Uh, Water Gun just does damage. Well, how much? I am... Um, hang on. I have to go through, like, several different wikis, I guess. Um... Power is 40 battle points? Whatever the fuck that means. Uh, I mean, I guess I probably wouldn't, like, want to use a move that's, like, half as good just because it might reduce speed. Yeah. So let's get rid of Bubble. Uh, Ivysaur, yes, we will change out Ivysaur. Alright, we'll change out for Ivysaur, rather. I don't... I don't think we can change our opponent's Pokémon. That should do more. Well, at least it's burned. That helps. I guess Ember is just not really a very good move. Even if it, is, it does have type. Mm -hmm. uh, so I'm hoping I get some better fire stuff later. You're using a potion? That's like the first time that's ever happened in this whole <laughs> playthrough. A trainer actually using an item. Although, no, I think I think we fought a gym leader who used like like X something. 
chomp. But it, like, didn't matter. Like, it was probably, you know, Surge, so... <laughs> Maybe it was Giovanni when we fought him at the rocket thing. How's your Pokedex coming? I just caught a Cubone. Cool, I just walked in the door and you started a freaking fight in a graveyard, so... Okay, well, I I don't remember what appears in here besides... Did I get poisoned somehow or what, or what is that? Yeah, I didn't even notice that happened. I guess I shouldn't have done the bite. <laughs> I just thought it would be a cool way to finish the fight and I got screwed. <laughs> uh, where the, where's the heck the Pokemon? Oh, uh, right. You walked right by it. Oh, no, you walked by the... Do, 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 uh, I'm dumb. Misty use an item? I don't remember, but it doesn't really matter. Like, I only- I think it only happened, like, once. <laughs> is my point. Like, Blue knows how to use items, but he doesn't know that Whirlwind and Teleport don't have any effect in a trainer battle. Um, so I don't really, uh, where did I put the guide? Oh, it's up there. <laughs> Desk space strikes again! I'm gonna prop it up. Yeah, I wanted to know if anything, like, besides, like, just ghosts and, like, I, I guess Cubone appears in here? I don't know. Uh, yeah. I don't remember what, like, the type stuff with ghost is. My point was, I thought I might need Raichu, so I, you know, went back. <laughs> And then it turns out I was poisoned, so I needed that anyway. <laughs> Even if we could not identify the wayward ghosts, a self scope might be able to unmask them. I do have that, right? I got that from Giovanni? Uh, Let me just, like, double check. Yeah. Yep. Okay. So otherwise, this would be very silly. <sighs> the chair is sagging again. The other day, I went to sit down, and the chair was, like, all the way down, and I hadn't noticed. Because it was only gone for like a minute. And then it just like, you know... Y you know that thing when you when you think you're gonna sit down, but then the thing is not there? Be gone, evil spirit. You're the evil spirit! You just showed up and you're like, like a lady from a... F I feel like in like 80s and 90s anime, having like a Shrine Maiden character was like a big thing. Yeah. Um... So do, do physical moves just, like, not work on ghosts, or...? I think normal moves don't work. Okay. But, you know, give it a try, if you want. <laughs> Immediately paralyzed, cool. Uh, what's good against ghost? Psychic, I think? No, isn't ghost supposed to be good against psychic? I don't know. But, like, I think it doesn't work right in Gen 1, but, like, that was the whole thing in the anime when Ash couldn't defeat Sabrina. He had to go to the Pokemon Tower and get a Haunter, and then the Haunter, like, screwed him over. But then it just decided to, like, troll Sabrina, and then Ash didn't need to actually win. You know, it's just usually how that went back then. Ash didn't actually win the fight, but he got a badge anyway. Lose the kind of guy to use Whirlwind to just try and blow up all of the lasses' skirts. <laughs> you ever see the first Japanese Pokemon intro? Where, like, it, it's sung by, like, Ash's VA, but, like, not in character, I think. Um, but it's, it, it's like, talking about, like, you know, going around looking everywhere for Pokemon in, like, all these different places and just, like, naming these places and then saying, like... And then, like, saying, like, also up that girl's skirt. As Pikachu, like, runs under the lass's skirt. <laughs> it's like... And then, if you listen to the full version, he does it again in the second verse? <laughs> well, he's here. Wow, she... I'll go anywhere. <laughs> he really does. Cat, cat, cat. Oh, no! This channeler's playing StarCraft. The predecessor to the Hex Girl. Damn that! Gas Ghastly in this, like, I like that, like, you know... 
when he standardized the designs, it just became like a ball with like purple flames. But I like that it's just like, you know, this vague shape with a face right now. For some reason, the face kind of reminds me of my brother. <laughs> you see what I mean? <laughs> you kind of look like him. A little bit, yeah. <laughs> Man, I was totally expecting, like, um, all sorts of, like, angry comments on my Pokemon video, being like, Oh, you're so bad at Pokemon! Burp -a -deep -a -doo. You know, like, on my shooter videos. But it actually hasn't happened. So I think the implication is, like, these channelers, like, fail at their jobs and all got possessed by the ghosts. Do we want a ghastly? Um... Probably couldn't hurt to have a ghost type if we need one. Uh, we can apparently get a haunt or two. I don't remember if that's a normal evolve. I think it's a normal evolve and then you have to trade it to get Gengar, right? Yeah, maybe. But also, like, there's various items you need to have, like, the Pokedex filled up enough to get, I think. That's a success. I suppose they succeeded in channeling, but, like, I don't think you're supposed to get, like, straight up possessed and start attacking people. Channel the ghost and then you're done. Never do more than what you're paid for. Yeah, exactly. Uh, what were you saying? Sorry? Me? Yeah. Well, there's, like, certain items I think you get by meeting Professor Oak's aid, and you have to have the Pokedex filled up to a certain extent to get them. Mm. So I should I should get Ghastly? Yeah, sure. Okay. Uh... No, I don't want... I don't want Corona to get knocked out, so... I'm getting licked! I'm getting licked and paralyzed! Oh shit, is that... It's all normal. Uh, I will put you to sleep, ghost! Or ghost, rather, because Gasly's Japanese name is Ghost. Oh right, it's, par it's paralysis. <laughs> I keep thinking it's sleep for some reason. Do I even have balls? I mean... Not those! <laughs> I didn't even have balls. Maybe I should get balls. I'm surprised it took this long to get to that joke. <laughs> I don't think transphobic Pokemon fans are a thing, otherwise I'm sure, I'm sure I would get comments on that exchange. But you know, fuck him. Yep. See, then I'm allowed to do it, right? Yeah. It's at the expense of transphobes, you can swear all you want. Yeah, fuck bigots. Of all different kinds, sorts. No, dang it, I wanted to get out of the conversation and I accidentally clicked back in. Great the ball we can get now. Uh, sure, that sounds good. Uh, get revives. I don't think we're really at a point where like revives are important yet, but we'll see. I'm sure there's gonna be like a like a, a time when I have like a big trek or something. Or like a really tough like gym battle, something like that. Something something Meryl. I, I don't know that reference. Alright, where was I? 
In a tower. I think she's sick. She's gonna vomit ectoplasm on me. You gotta force feed her some Bepto Bismol. I just keep getting reminded of the freaking uh, the channeler girl from Urusei Yatsura. The crazy <laughs> one. Yeah. Uh, yeah, all I would be able to use with Corona is Ember, which sucks apparently, so. Uh, what about Aqua? Do you want to use somebody else? Yeah, I was just looking at kind of levels here, and I'm like, okay, Kinoko wasn't doing so hot. I don't know if Veil would be any good here. Maybe you could literally blow the ectoplasm away. Well, I, I'm trying to catch it, aren't I? I mean, you're in a battle, aren't you? With another trainer? Uh, all right, I am. See, go Ghastly's just show up on their own anyway, so I forgot. Okay, this is all normal, except for Fly. <laughs> well, okay. Good work, Veil. Shouldn't have named her after an engaged character. <laughs> <laughs> there we go! Yeah! That's how you do it! Did we use Veil at all in Engage? I don't remember. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we used her because she leveled up pretty well. Meryl has different gender distributions to Azrael, so people suppose they change genders when they evolve. I was just assumed two thirds of the female ones die or something. That's not as fun. It's not fun at all, actually. <laughs> Do you actually get experience at all when you catch a Pokemon, or no? Only when you KO them. Okay. Yeah. Okay, uh, ghost girls, ghost girls. We need ghost anime girls. Oh, shit. Um. I feel like this should be easy. But I'm blanking right now. Oh, um. Frickin', um. <laughs> Rukia. Oh, yeah! I, I was gonna go for something else, but Rukia's good. Yeah, Rukia. I was thinking of, um... Pick up Leech before. character. Orihime, damn it! What's the name of the show? It's, uh... if we it's a good show, but I can never remember its title. Um, if we had enough characters, we could call it Closet Ghost. Closet Ghost? <laughs> yeah. Well, who knows? You might end up getting a Haunter. What was the rope here? Um, no, it's like, uh, something something amnesia. And I always get the title mixed up with a wind called amnesia, which is a completely different thing. But it's, it's like a, um... It's like a high school thing, and there's this ghost girl, and it's like a romance, the ghost girl. It's a pretty good show. I can just never remember what the full title is. <laughs> pretty sure the girl's name in that was Yuko, so that's what I was gonna go with until she be said. Yeah. How do you paralyze a ghost? Ha 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 ha! I am ghost! Gus, 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 gus! <laughs> More ghastly? How ghastly! Breaking Kame House!
you from Puyo has a twin named Ray. That's fantastic. <laughs> Elixir, and it's spelled wrong! It's also like, um... Fairly certain it's called something more setting appropriate in Japanese. I don't know why they went with Elixir in English. Beat me not? Okay. <laughs> More like he licks her. <laughs> Someone gives this give this sheep a, his own show. Donk. That's not what I meant to do. It's always kind of been weird to me that because of like version stuff and like Pokemon you can only get through like in-game trades, that there's just like, you know, even if you just casually play through a Pokemon game, there's just like mons you'll never really encounter. So when I think about licks, obviously I think about like Licky Tongue, and I think that's an in-game trade. Don't like later ghastly sprites play up its tongue more? Or am I thinking of a different Pokemon? Not in my mind's eye, but... How are you paralyzed and confused and you still end up hitting yourself? <laughs> uh, it's, it's like wiggling around and then it falls over. Oh. Oh my god. Aqua, please! That was silly. Maybe I should have brought some paralyzed heals, but where was I going again? Now it is me who is the confused. Ether is PP aid and Elixir is PP aider. <laughs> Silly. Okay, I guess I know why I didn't go with the Japanese name exactly, but I still don't know what I want with Elixir. Like, it's just like some old bearded alchemist in the Pokemon world. Like, oh, I know how to recover your shit. Ah, dang it. Stuff. Stuff. You recover your stuff, okay? Dang it. She's working out fairly decently here. I burned a ghost somehow. I could have gone with naming everything like that, but I mean, I guess you do have potions, which I think are also called something else in Japanese. It just elixir seems like specifically weird to me because potion is just such a like standard RPG thing at least. They're just like, oh, of course, any setting is going to have potions. I think the English um, SNES version of Final Fantasy VI actually, like, renames them to, like, tonics or something. In, like, a Ted Woolsey attempt to make the setting a little more consistent, maybe? That didn't last, though. 
Face me! Maybe the Lord Souls. Oh, I already defeated you. Never mind! Boo! It's another Ghastly! Imagine using an unguent or in the opposite direction. What if full restores or ambrosia? What the hell is an unguent? Ghost. Silly channeler. It's spelled ghost. I don't know. Maybe she saw a haunter. That one's called ghost. I'm pretty sure in Japanese. Some of the Japanese names weren't very creative. <laughs> I think, like, the evolutions are just, like, flamey and things like that. No, I think... Where's that Growlithe? Is Growlithe flamey? I don't know. I think Articuno is just, like, Freezer and, s and stuff like that. Better than naming them after all after like, I don't know, food or something. <laughs> it's like an oilier version of an ointment. Now I know. Goodbye, ghosts. Oh, cool, it's another ghastly. Neat. Come, child, I seal this space with white magic. There's white magic? What? I can't get into this space. There was a ghastly adjacent to me. Purified protected zone. Redsy's Pokemon are fully healed. That's cool. Alright, time to, time to fight this person. Give me your soul. An unhappy encountering music plays. I think I know why later games like add more like types of encounter music. Oh, it's a honor. Night sheet, the claws of Sutek. Veil cannot be licked. Probably because of Nintendo Treehouse. Stupid Treehouse. <laughs> well, it worked out for us in this case. Yeah. Gasp. Must be near the top then, I guess, if, if we're in this healing thing. Either that or the exact middle of the tower, but... Okay, we got more of these people. Uh... Zombies? I don't think there's zombie Pokemon yet. I found out recently that there's like zombie Pokemon now, and I'm just like, what the heck? <laughs> what is this? Oh, 
Uncle, please. Okay. I was gonna be really annoyed if we were gonna get a repeat of that. Huh? That's what I'd like to know. Some of these channelers have been ghost gagged. Oh no. No, no, that's not what I meant to do. I'm gonna guess it can't hurt. Ghost gag is maybe still less horrifying than getting tied up by a Mr. Mime, though. Oh my god! Why? Self-scope version. <laughs> I should remember that as like a Patreon incentive. <laughs> Someone just left a nugget of gold in this ghost tower. Did we just grow? Did we just rob a grave? Is that what just happened? We're in the pure zone, bro. The pure zone. Pure zone! I'm not interested in your ghost wares, please. Make a game with a graveyard area you should make a, a good place to farm rare flower items. Sure. Give me blood in a Nintendo game? You can't have blood in a Nintendo game? Ghastly all at once. I don't really get like encounters where it's just like the same Pokemon over and over. Unless it's like a joke. Because it's like, either either you're well equipped to deal with it and it, it's just, you know, a waste of time. Or you're not equi well equipped to deal with it and you can make the point a lot quicker. Yeah. Oh no, the StarCraft is back. <laughs> Oh boy, Ghastly, I didn't see that coming. Bye. Key. Is that all you have to say? What's going on here?
Lily says, I vaguely remember, like, exactly one time in Gen 2, I think, where the same Pokémon clearly had a completely different moveset and I was impressed. That's pretty cool. We should do that more. Something fell out. A ghost? Hair didn't fall out, it was an evil spirit. Okay. I feel like that was funnier in Japanese somehow. Be gone, intruders. Whoa! <gasps> ghost! It's a Marowak. So I believe... This is, like, the only one you can't catch, right, in the yeah. game? Yeah. Marowak has always looked cool to me. Don't mess with an angry mom. A bunch of bosses in the new games have exactly two moves. I feel like, you know, Pokemon games have kind of, like, you know... I mean, I haven't played the, like, newest ones, but I've heard that, you know, the, the ongoing problem that was, ha that like, made me quit playing new Pokemon games. That that's still an issue, um... And I don't really understand why they would want to dumb it down so much, because if anything, like... Aren't kids probably better at RPGs now than they were back then? You'd think. How did you guys get up here? Why, why didn't the ghost kick your ass? Maybe that's all, what all of those tombstones are for. All the rocket goons who couldn't make it up. This one buff Zubat. Anyway. Oh, you have more Zubat! I see. I'm still confused, though. <laughs> ah, now, now the strategy comes out. That's what they're counting on. They've been here since before the Marowak died. They haven't eaten or drank anything in months. You're still putting up quite a fight considering. Also, they're Pokemon. Oh, that should do more. This is incorrect. I'm supposed to win. My defense fell. That's probably not a good sign. Let's put Toka in. <laughs> you are shock! Jesus Christ, that, that gold bat sprite. <laughs> gold bat's like a meter tall too, right? Yeah. It's all mouth. I'm not going to forget this. I'll forget you. I mean, you don't even have a name. You all look like M. Bison. I know I'm face blind, but y'all literally look like M. Bison. Goffin! I'm kind of okay with, like, inefficient fights if I don't get my ass kicked too hard, and I can just get XP. Yeah. Come on, I should have finished him off. Was it meant to be this way?
Get out of here, you creepy creeper. I need to enhance my like vocabulary of non-swears if I'm gonna do this. These guys are all really talkative. They're, they're, and then they all stalk off like they're blue. <laughs> oh man, lost again. Mm. This really rattles my hat. Because that's where they keep their money. Because you know when you when you're in like like a like a bad uh, like like when you're working with the bad guys, you can't trust the other bad guys either. So they keep their money in their hat. You should make like a version of Zubat that has like rockets and call it Zoombat. That's what we like to see. Rattata! No, not eradicate. No, not this nonsense. Them apples. The dirty rat. No, oh, that's not supposed to happen, is it? Don't you dare. Who did these radicates bribe to get all those crits? <laughs> Don't fight us, rockets! We'll lose! Oh no! A wild Mr. Fuji appeared! Came to calm the soul of Cubone's mother. Well, you didn't do a very good job, did you, old man? Yeah, I beat the crap out of it to send it to the afterlife. Maybe you should try that. Seems to, seems to work pretty well. He kidnapped me to his house. Go. Your Pokedex quest may fail without love for your Pokemon. Are you saying I don't take care of my Pokemon? I'll fucking fight you on the street, you old bastard! Okay, so we could go fight... 
uh, Erica. Mm -hmm. And I think we can also, like, get past the Snorlax now with the Poke Flute, and, um... Then we could go to... Uh... Fuchsia. Yeah. I, I think Erica is the next one. Yeah, it's just that, you know, we wanted to get that, uh, Dratini, right? So I'm trying to decide if we should prioritize that. We might as well get another badge at this point. It's been forever. Yeah. Beep, boop, boop, beep, boop, 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 boop. Beep. We'll get to the gym. How do I get there? I'm being bamboozled right oh, now. Yeah, that way. You're 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 gonna have to cut. Oh, they're all the way over here. I just look like that was like you know like no man's land out there. Nature-loving princess. I don't think that's a real title. You're not allowed in here. Why not? You gotta, like, let me challenge the gym leader for a badge. Otherwise, I'm reporting you to the Indigo League. <laughs> Joke's on you, that hasn't been invented in the franchise yet. What do you mean? Is it the Indigo League an anime thing? Because it's just called the Elite Four, right? At the Indigo Plateau! I mean, I guess it's just the Pokemon League, but... <laughs> Regardless, <laughs> I'm sure there's an authority here I can be like, Hey, you know, uh, one, of you, one of your gyms is, uh... Not really, like, being very competitive here. Oh, we'll, uh, report that to the head of ethics. In this world? Yeah, uh, they're, they're also, uh, the, um, uh, the, the Viridian City Gym Leader. Ah. <laughs> oh my god! Fucking stop it! Eliminate all bell sprouts from the world! And just anything that uses rap in Gen 1, really. This is stupid! They're gonna, uh, they're gonna separate all bell sprouts out of the wild and find, like, you know, one specific building to stash them in. Get out of here. Get out of here! Weeping Bell's face, and that probably just looks like it's constantly going. Duh! Princess versus princess. I think that was that was an anime episode. <laughs> Too rough? You were squeezing my Pokémon to death! <laughs> and forcing me to watch! And, and you poisoned one of them! What is wrong with you? Freaking come here to do competitive sports? And you just murder my friends? Oh god, where the hell is the Pokémon? <laughs> 
What a <laughs> bitch! <laughs> it's too large town, really. Should have just been an NPC. Was like my Pokemon fanned it because I couldn't find the freaking Pokemon Center. Very sporting of you. I was getting bored. Okay. Good for you. Maybe you should have brought a book. Oh, it's the Onesan! That is one odd Pokemon. Oh. Did you know that, like, canonically, lasses evolve into beauties? Hmm. Again. Ooh, I'm gonna roll you up and s put you in a joint and smoke you, you piece of shit. There are two things <laughs> where I'm allowed to swear. Bigots and bell sprouts. <laughs> Is that like some sort of twisted uh, tabletop RPG game? Bigots and bell sprouts. <laughs> that doesn't sound like much fun to me. I don't think that will make it out of play testing. Get blasted! I didn't mean to go in here. Didn't know there was gonna be a door. Take me for some kind of door connoisseur? No. Come to go to the big mart. cat again? Yep. There's this weird near needy cat hanging out in our neighborhood. <laughs> like, there's nothing wrong with it as far as we can tell. It just likes to go meow, meow, a lot. I 
it said there would be a drugstore, I kind of expected, like, you know, medicine? Like, it's, it's not what's happening. Can the pay tribute? Tribute? Wish to go to the down zone, please. Fast forward, it's too fast! I didn't even see the gap! I'm back. Oh, there's more people here to beat up. I will burn down this entire gym. Look at my grass Pokemon. More like ass Pokemon! That's right. I swim there. Oh, another bell sprout. grass Pokemon and make flower arrangements like you put them in the flower arrangements or maybe they are the flower arrangement weird happy anniversary dear I got you a bouquet of uh, bell sprouts I want a divorce <laughs> aren't you the peeping Tom no, he's outside! Look, you can see him in the window right now! Worse face blindness than I've got on this girl! Where'd you get a Bulbasaur? I bar flame on you. Yeah, I'm in shock, but I didn't use Toka. God damn it. I didn't even I didn't even notice I got poisoned. Again! Better not underestimate girl power. I really want to like know what all this text is in the remake if you like actually play as a female character. <laughs> Are you the peeping Jane? 
Because you can keep looking if you are. You're that lesbian that's been hanging around the gym? Because we're all lesbians, but you know... You don't have to hide it here. <laughs> Come back on Tuesdays. That's orgy night. Give someone else a shot here. Oh boy, it's gloom. Now, 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 it really is an ass Pokemon. Cause it smells like ass. Anyway, I'm a body slam it. No, I am the sleep. Anyway. What? Come on. Dude, this is like the downside of like the AI being like completely random. Mm -hmm. Is like they'll use moves where it's like there's no way like like if you hadn't done a certain thing to counter their last thing, there's no way they would have like you know had any effect with that next move. But because you played smart, you actually played worse. Because it's like, if I hadn't used that awakening, then the paralysis would have been pointless because I already had a status effect. It's like, you know, when they tee up one Pokémon to do like a devastating blow, and then you switch it out, and then all of a sudden it's like, Oh, I'm gonna do a status lower move. Even though there would have been no point. Oh, it's a cool trainer. Our first one. How did that tree grow back behind me while I was doing that? I didn't bring my next Pokemon. That doesn't sound like it's my problem. Wait, did I not? I meant to buy potions and I somehow forgot. center in this town, in this city, in this village, in this bubble, in this tree. Oh, I still didn't buy potions. <laughs> no! Rosie can't remember anything! We'll just have to do our best. Don't bring any bugs or fire Pokemon in here. Well, I have news for you. Both. I actually forgot that, like, Bug would be good here. That makes sense. I'm noticing a lot of, like, you know, trying to dictate the rules. Like, oh, you can't use Pokemon that are good against our Pokemon. You can't come in here. 
Mm -hmm. It's like, I think you people just maybe aren't very good trainers. <laughs> I mean, of course just... they're not very good. They stick to one fucking type. Damn it. One fudging type. Okay, is Erica standing there with a girl on each arm? Yeah. Wow. And then there was, like, another one to the side, like, I don't know, to take photos or something. I never understand Pokemon that are clearly multiple organisms. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like you're gonna be walking on eggshells. Do something, Corona. She brought Paralyze Heal, too. Does Paralysis go away on its own, or...? It's Friday in California today. Erica, you need to do something about these ladies in your gym. I think they're ruining your good name. You know, assuming you have one. <laughs> Come on! This is so unfair! What the fuck?! Oh. How the hell did the game go out like that? Like, there's so many, so many times you have to, like, deal with that move. And they were just like, oh, no, that's fine. Oh my god. Like, if it goes first, you're just- you're just fucked! This is not remotely fair! Is this her last Pokémon? Hers? Yeah. No. Oh, well, shit. Lightning's not good against grass, right? For some reason. Yeah. Oh, 
Oh, fuck off! What? Need a fucking super potion. No, we're not doing this! Ugh. You know, I noticed that, like, these these Pokemon games keep having, like, one gym leader who has, like, one thing that's the worst ever, and it's always, like, a girl you fight, like, around the middle of the game. <laughs> I can never get over how this thing's perspective is not even remotely correct. It looks like it's tipping its, like top at you. Well, it's, yeah, it's like taking its own top off. That's the only way that that makes sense. How is it thrashing about? It's a fucking flower! How does that hurt me? Is it poison ivy? I'd fly. I'm flying. <laughs> Into the roof! <laughs> Now Veil is the thing flying into Wait, people. Wait, fly face. is effective? I, I guess. I guess I, I, like... <laughs> I guess there was, like, a specific Pokemon with grass before that, like, another type, and that made fly not effective or something. If I'd known that shit... Okay, you're going to jail. Like, can we just dress her up in a rocket uniform and then, like, take her to police? Seriously, how that be this game was in development for like a millennium? How did no one ever pick up on how bullshit that is? Cause there's just literally nothing you can do. I mean maybe just have like a million potions or something, but is that really how you want to play the game? to Fuchsia from here, we'd have, we need Surf, I guess, right? Uh, it goes over the sea. Yeah. So I guess I gotta go to Vermilion to get the Fuchsia. Yeah. Swoosh! My Machop can beat your Machop at Machopping. Well, mine's a Machoke. Oh. And Machoking. Oh my. <laughs> Let's go, but don't cheat. What do you think I am, Erica? <laughs> Let's oh, go cheat. Oh, oh, kid, you are not ready for this. Oh my god! <laughs> kid, we have seen some stuff.
That's not right. What do you mean? I'm just... I, maybe you should go to Celadon City. Okay? Is this the direction where the, the Snorlax is, I hope? What, what are we gonna name a Snorlax, y'all? Hmm... Do we have a sleepy anime girl? Uh, there's the sleepy princess in the Devil's Castle, I guess. But I feel like there's, like, other characters. I feel like there's options and we're just not, you know... Yeah. Get out of here. Get out of here! I had a chance. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. I'm laying down some cables? Maybe you should put up a sign. Remember if Magnemite actually counts as like, you know, it's not flying, it's like how flying, right? So, and this will work. That was electric. No! No, that was ground type. Watch out for live wires! That's what I'm always telling people. I'm trying to remember anime girls who look like giant pandas. I don't I don't even know that many like giant anime girls in general, let alone pandas. A surprising amount of Pokemon where they're just like, uh, what's its evolution? I we just we just have a bunch of them. <laughs> it's fine. Girls who are red pandas, but that doesn't count. It sure doesn't. is happening. Belly raid? <laughs> Who's belly? That's what I want to know. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Oh, God, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> oh, wow. We, we, we got raided. Really? Well, this is my first raid raided. ever. Are, are you a real streamer now? I maybe. Wow. Oh. Yay! This is probably my most viewers ever then. Oh hell, well now I now I feel really pressured to be funny. <laughs> Don't worry, just be yourself. That's not funny! <laughs> I mean <laughs> <laughs> Uh God, I I, I... Oh Thank you for following, also, and, uh, you know, in addition to the raid. 
Ah, this has never happened to me before. <laughs> Such a mix of emotions, I'm panicking. Uh, alright, we can just, we can just use the flute and then, like, fight it, right? Yeah, do you have balls? Uh, I have balls. Okay. You know, great ones. Somewhere. Oh, yeah, man. there they are. Oh man, that Gen One item menu. Oh. Yeah, I, I, I think you press select to reorder items. Ah, good luck with the game. We didn't do so well. I'm, <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that. I don't know what you were playing though. <laughs> what were you playing? Maybe this. It could be. That was my first. Oh thought. no! It attacks me in a grumpy rage. It's Egoraptor. <laughs> So are you not so grump in this situation? Um... Well, right now I'm not so grump, but I got, I got raided, that's cool. Oh, a Nuzlocke! I've never done a Nuzlocke because I'm, like, scared. I'll, like, mess it up and kill all my Pokémon and I'll be sad. <laughs> um... Okay, so I probably don't want to paralyze it because it'll probably put itself to sleep, right? Yeah. So all I should do is... damage it. Yeah. And I don't even need to damage it a lot. Yeah, rest, and then... Oh, it immediately, like, regains its health. Uh, it's gonna keep doing that, isn't it? Oh, it's not. Um, uh, try it! Yeah, now, now we should be good, because it's damaged and asleep. Come on, RNG! What?! <laughs> you were asleep! How did you get out? Oh no, it's awake! <laughs> Oh, you were killing your chat? Oh god. <laughs> is it, I, I would like, I would be too scared to put myself in a situation like that. It is gonna keep doing that. It's gonna keep doing that. No, go back to sleep! You must sleep! Oh, how much does rest recover? So this is the part where, like, me, like, you know, not playing this game for, like, 20 years is really gonna bone me. Uh, Maybe just try and paralyze him. I guess I could. At least it would stay paralyzed, then. Rest is 50%. I don't want to kill you! You're my friend! Oh, come on! What?! <laughs> Rest <laughs> recovered its status ailment too! No PP left. Oh. Uh, it's done it again, I guess. Well, if it's just gonna do rest, then there's gonna be no point. Right. I want the Snorlax! <laughs> like, I'm sure I could beat it up if I wanted to. Maybe. Um, okay, Toka could stun it if necessary. I missed oh, How? It. Honey, why? It's too it's, big! It's not, it's not actually what that means. <laughs> okay, are you gonna use rest or are you just gonna be a bitch? Customer, I tell ya. Uh, you know what? Let's not even damage it. Let's just go straight for the ball. Nope. Oh, now it stays asleep, huh? That's how that's going. And this doesn't even do, like, anything to it. Oh my god. I thought this was gonna be easy. I swear to god. Oh my god, I'm getting wiped by the Snorlax! It's so angry. Um... Oh, I have like nothing with like good status stuff. Ugh. Just keep trying, I, we might just have to reload. I should've... I should've saved. I really should've saved. I thought you did! Did I? I thought you did. That was a long time ago. Mm. Stay in the ball! Oh my god! Am I missing a factor here? Because it's damaged 
And it's got, like, a status effect, so... I feel like the only way it could be better is if it was asleep, but that clearly didn't work. Time to try again. Can I run? Nah, uh, not from this, I don't think. Mm. Oh well, I mean, I guess it'd be better to get the balls anyway. I just, I don't remember for sure if I saved. <laughs> I can only sleep five times. I guess that's something. I mean, like, you're either gonna KO it, or mm. have to reload. There is, a, there is a second Snorlax we can get, right? So. Yeah. I guess we could just, you know, see how far we can get here. Oh. What type is Snorlax even? Normal. <sighs> so angry. I'm do I did a quick Google. Oh, 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 you can just run. I did a quick Google, and it was only 20 to 30 great balls. What do you mean? Uh, they're, they're joking. They're being like, it took a ungodly number of great balls. Just, like, as, like, a, a, an example of, like, how long, how much that can take? Yeah. There's a glitch where if you burn it, it'll keep the damage output down after cleansing it with rest. Might be cool. I will keep that in mind for the other Snorlax, then. I didn't realize you could just run away and it would be gone. Do you want to try and reload the game and... No, we'll, we'll do that when we get to the other one. Right, just... Make sure you remember to save. <laughs> but I did save! <laughs> Thank you, I will enjoy. Hope to see you again next time. We, we oh. embrace the jank. My Pokemon should be ready by now. He was getting ready the whole time I was fighting that Snorlax. What is this kid doing the getter pose? Well, he saw it on TV and he thought it was cool. Cut. That's all. Cut him. Alright, I will. Everything's quiet now after that. <laughs> Complete pandemonium. Yeah. Nidorino's sprite's actually pretty good. Can you give me the book? Uh, sure. So I'm thirsty. I might be going to grab a drink. You could refill my water too, then. That was also what I was thinking. Wow. Gonna look and see if it has any, like, info on catching the, the Snorlax. I don't remember, like, the precise route I took through this route. This route route. So I may very well just run into more random trainers here. And, What's up here? And you said that, like, um... Uh, coding-wise, Great Balls are better than Ultra Balls, right? Uh, I think in most situations. Oh, I need to catch eight more Pokemon to get an item finder. Or I could just look at a guide. Oh, uh, no. Russ is 100% heal in this gen. Oh, gen one. You card. You trading card game. Oh, we're finally in the fishing area. We're... It's it's good that we're doing this because uh, I need rod. What route was that Snorlax in? Uh, I'll check after this fight, I guess. So now one of these 
men with a cable knife. Oh, we're just doing that. You know, I don't think you can win a fight that way, sir. Yeah, the, the guide recommends an Ultra Ball, but, you know, maybe maybe the guides did not know about the crazy coding nonsense. I also, like, I actually don't know where to get Ultra Balls around here. I, I didn't even do anything in this fight. I just got exploded twice in a row, and then I won. Who does this guy remind me of with his hair? Um, a certain, like, anime character. God, there's so many anime characters I get like Android that. I Android 17, maybe. Water conducts electricity, so you should zap C Pokemon. I knew that because I have been to the gym in Cerulean. But, like, uh... What was your strategy there, exactly? Okay, I, I'm pretty sure somewhere around here we get a rod. I just don't know from who exactly. I'd rather be working. I wouldn't. Does it say in the guide, like, where you get rod? Um... Uh, the, uh, the old rod, right? Yeah, I think... I think you have to get them in order? I'm not sure. We're gonna need the best rod, I think, to get the Dratini later. Uh, you get it in Vermilion City from the Fishing Guru. He's in the city? Yeah. Oh, we'll have to go back then. Because I don't think I got that. Then you get the good rod in Fuchsia from the Fuchsia Fishing Guru. Mm. A fun phrase to say. Uh... Fuchsia Fishing Guru. Then there's a super rod, right? Yes. I think we need that one. Probably. Where, where do you where do you get that one? Hang on. Uh, route twelve. There's a fishing guru uh, on a bridge or something, I guess. Uh, where's route twelve? Hang on. Uh, it's faster. Route 12 is uh, south of Lavender Town, which okay. you are at. Wait, so is that where I was just now? Yeah. Oh. I, I don't know if I'm supposed to get each rod in order if or, or if we can just get them whenever. I have not the faintest idea either. I'm the fishing guru. I simply love fishing. Do you like to fish? Sure. Grand, I like your style. Take this and fish, young one. I guess we'll just go on the route and see what happens. Yeah. Shouldn't be too much of an issue to just walk back if, you know, it doesn't work. <laughs> just, uh, just speed my way through here a bit. Uh, yeah, there's a house partway through. You go in there and talk to the guy. It does not say in the book that you need the other, uh, the other rod. Okay. Um, is it... Do we need to go north or south? South. Oh, okay. I was probably really close to it then and just went the other way. Yeah, uh, it's to. like right south of here, actually, I think. You can always count on me to make, like, whatever decision is the least efficient. I'm the fishing guru's brother. I simply love fishing. Do you like to fish? Yes. Oh no. I had a gift for you, but you have no room. God. Always with the backpack. Uh, is there anything I can just use up? I don't think so. Keep going in circles to Vermilion City. To visit Stella. Bye bye, sheep. See you later.
Whenever I see this guy, I think he's like a delivery guy from the later games. Scope and uh, oh, we could sell that nugget and this. And I don't again. I don't know if we need that rod or not. So I was gonna keep it for now. I don't think I ever bothered with fishing playing this as a kid. I think I tried it and I was just like, oh, you just keep getting magic carp. Who cares? <laughs> Like you can just go to a convenience store and sell gold nuggets. There's like no authority that like has something to say about that. Ugh. All right, who else have we still got in chat right now? Me. Except I'm over here. You're in. You're in the flesh chat. Yeah, I'm in the the flesh chamber. The flesh chamber? The flesh chamber. That sounds messed up. Yeah, probably. Yes, I like fishing. Please give me this thing. That's that's the best one, right? The super rod? Yes. All right. And now we can just go south to Fuchsia. Uh, I don't know what that's about. I don't know. Do we have room? Yeah, I, I put a bunch of stuff in the computer. Okay. I sold the nugget. You never know what you could catch. I caught you, for example. Yeah, I was gonna say, that's a weird thing to say when you're hiding in the bushes, <laughs> and you, you find a child. <laughs> At least it's only Magikarp, so the worst that's gonna happen is that one scene from Slayers. does not like the flash chamber. <laughs> and yet it brought you back into active chatting, I noticed. So well, what were you doing hiding in the bushes? Oh, I was fly fishing, he says, as he just waves his rod up in the air. I found iron. It's, uh, it's not how you fly fish. Nonsense! I'm sure a bird will fly into this eventually. Wait, is that what fly fishing is? No! Oh. <laughs> not at all. I don't know! Uh, okay, so to the best of my knowledge, fly fishing is like you stand in like a deep moving river uh, and you need special rods for it and you kind of like wave it back and forth and it dra like has the bait swing just like above the water because I think it's supposed to catch fish that like jump out. So like they'll jump out to get the bait and I think then like, you know, they bite the hook and whatnot. It's been a while since I read A River Runs Through It, which is whether you want it to be or not, a very, very ex extensive explanation of fly fishing. And also something about this guy's family. I don't know, what a terrible memoir. I hated having to read it in high school. Well, I'm glad I didn't have to. Yeah. What works in here? I am not taking good care of my moms right now. Really I'm sure they fish won't fish. turn a bit against you and launch a rebellion. Did you know that was like? I wonder if there's like special Pokemon here or something. There doesn't seem to be anything else of note. Ugh, hang on. Not that I have balls, but Pidgey. Wow, that's really cool. That's a strong ass Pidgey, also. Um. Oh, you can find Venonat. Uh huh. So, um, also in these are um, Gloom and Oddish. Oh. I think we're good on that front. Uh, I think Takeshi Shudo originally wanted to end the Pokemon anime with the Pokemon revolting, 
<laughs> led, by, led by Ash's Pikachu. Oh, I would've loved it. My bird Pokemon won a scrap. Well, here's the iron I found. Alright, I'm gonna get that drink. Here's book back. Thank. Thank thank for book. Don't put it on the keyboard! I'm sorry, y'all, I needed someplace to put it. If anything's wrong with the stream now, blame Noth. Anyway, you know, I, I, I could have sworn that fast forwarding used to just have like, blah, 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 but now it's just quiet. Yeah, I got your water. I'm gonna put it on the keyboard. Let me get to Fuchsia, please. Oh, you have a lot of Pokemon. I'm gonna wrestle your cat. I'm gonna wrestle your rat. I'm gonna wrestle your other rat. I'm gonna wrestle your other cat. Okay, there's a theme here, I think. Man, am I glad I had fast forward for that. And then I just picked up that Meow's money. <laughs> North the Silence Bridge. I don't remember that location name at all. I just want to go to Fuchsia. Goodness gracious, man. are we on right now? Let's look at the look at the map for this. Okay, so we go there. Uh, can't go there. All right, it doesn't look like there's a super efficient way to do this because there's going to be trainers in the way. Look at the book over here. Like, no matter what we do, we're gonna have to fight some folks. <laughs> I kinda love that the music just cuts out like that. You totally won. I sure did. Um, and I'm in the right spot. I think we go here, and then there's a trainer there. Oh, I actually could have avoided him. The wind's blowing my way. No, it's not. Oh, Pidgey. Uh, bye. Oh, a Spearow. Bye. Oh, a Spearow. Bye. <laughs> I feel kind of bad, but not really that much. It feels like no matter what direction we go in, we have to fight the same amount of people. Oh. Am I going to the right place here? There we go. I'm just gonna pass you? Uh, and this is... Fairly... Oh. <laughs> I could have gone behind those guys. We ride out here because there's more room. 
Oh shoot, I might actually have to try now. Oh, that doesn't work. Hmm. Oh, what? Oh. Get out of here. So, what have I missed? Um, I'm trying to really hard to just get the fuchsia, but there's so many routes. So many trainers. It's it's uh, uh it's kind of weird how many like things you have to do to get the fuchsia. And I guess if I wasn't trying to do a specific thing in fuchsia, it wouldn't like you know be that obvious. But it's not like I don't want to fight these people at all. It's just I don't feel like it right now. So. And I feel like this whole place is designed kinda with that in mind. Of like, oh you can you can do this later if you wanna. Oh god damn it. Freaking ninjas by the side of the road over here. Hang on. Wait. Yeah. My my birds are shivering. You're good, aren't you? What? How? Who? Man, what are you saying? Seems very Japanese superhero to say something like that. Anyway, he lost, so... There we go! I love how it gives you, like, like, a couple pixels more of route, just to mess with you. <laughs> Alright, uh, Pokemon Center, please. I guess we gotta go through this building. And also, um, that map says shop. Was this taken from the Japanese version? It might have been. Oh, maybe we need to just cut the thing. What is it with these towns where, like, Pokemon centers are, like, frickin' out of the way? I gotta, like, cut all sorts of stuff? Wait, it's all the- how do I even get there? What? Oh, you go up and... Oh, okay, I see. You didn't even have to cut. Um, so... I yeah. see. Do you? Yeah. What a stupid town layout, though. Look, you can barely even tell on the map that there's a gap there, so I was just like, how the hell do you get over there? Oh, there's a gap there? Where does that even go on? That leads down to uh, the uh, the next route. You can't go. You can't take that oh. gap to the rest of the city. Yeah. Okay. Man, that was the most stressful like town experience. So when it comes to the safari zone. Uh, it's, it's just stupid RNG, isn't it? I think it is. I have never been all that successful with the Safari Zone. Like, I think one of the videos I watched was, like, don't even bother with, like, the rocks or the bait, just throw balls. I don't know how true that is, but... I love that the second thing in chat is still, uh, the Flesh Chamber. <laughs> My favorite Sonic Adventure 2 level. Is it your first time here? 
Safari Zone has four zones. Each zone has different kinds of Pokemon. Use Safari Balls to catch him. Uh, Each zone <laughs> is a different flavor of stupid. For example, in Zone 2, somebody is following behind you with a whoopee cushion. It will go off randomly. Uh, we also got, got to get, like, an item in there, right? I think... One of your expeditions into the Safari Zone, you need to reach the Secret House. Make your way to Area 2, lower left exit. Secret House is the northwest corner of Area 3. The dude inside gives you Hidden Machine 3. He's gonna one of your Pokemon, and you can swim. Okay. Right. Also make sure you snag the gold teeth while on a safari is on their slowly to the right of the secret house. Okay, uh, I don't think this thing lists, like, fishable Pokemon, so I might have to look up where we need to go. Uh, are there water-type Pokemon listed in those tables? Because they might just be included there. No, I, I'm just, like, not seeing anything like that. Okay. Uh, could you look it up, or should I? Um... I'm gonna get to Dratini. Hang on. In area three or four, there's, like, little ponds or something. Right, and those have Dratinis in them? Uh, according to, uh, Google and Game Facts. Okay. Oh no, um, this might be an issue. Yeah? It's, uh, it's listing the first area's just entrance here, and then saying one, two, three. So I don't know if these are gonna be consistent things. So time is time is steps, right? It's not real time? Yeah, no, it's number of steps you take. Okay. It's always weird to me that it's just the evolution music in here. Yeah. Throw back to playing East looking at this much at a map. <laughs>
shit, am I in the wrong place? This place is kind of hard to navigate. <laughs> yep. Pulling up the map. Uh, are you... Which way did you leave to? What do you mean? Like, from the, uh, entrance zone. Uh, well, I went east, because I think that's the only thing I could do. Okay, yep. Um... When you get out, I can tell you where you're at. Uh, I know where I am at, I'm just, you know, I'm having trouble, yep. like, navigating. Because the print size is so small. Uh, and now I need to go... Down? I believe. Hang on, hang on. That shouldn't have been right. Or do we need to go all the way around to get to the house? Okay, yeah, I need to go around. This might be a good fishing spot, though, so let me just try it. There are... damn, there's actually several houses here. Yeah, but I, I think I know which house it is. It's a secret house. Mm. Is it the one with the Pokémon statues? Oh, yes. Yes, it is. Yes. Okay. Let's get there you want. Oh, shit! Well, uh... Ball. He's... Damn it, Stella! <laughs> this is why everyone was so impressed with Iki. <laughs> That's a Shizuku if I've ever seen one. <laughs> it's also not what we wanted. No, I wanted to put it there. How do I swap items? Like that. Okay. That's really not, like... Very... Okay, it should make it, it should make a sound. <laughs> No. What what would what would we name Psyduck? Hmm. I uh, hmm. I have an idea because just just entirely because of the expression where it looks like it's like pained by the, all of the mental power. Mm-hmm. Bochi. <laughs> what will we name a slowpoke? Oh, hell. Um, I feel like sheep would have something immediately. Um... Hmm. Oh, man, 
I don't know, something lazy. I wonder if the RNG is determined, like, when you throw the ball, or, like, as soon as you go into the battle and it, like, does a seed thing. I don't know. You're the you're the man with the info right now, so. Oh no, I'm not. I'm just googling. Yeah, you have the entire world's incorrect info, <laughs> maybe. The most exciting stream footage there is. Fishing! Man, I cannot even begin to imagine if we ever stream like Final Fantasy XV, how much of it will be me fishing. Come on, Yoshi P. When are you going to put fishing in a Final Fantasy XVI? I'm sure the DLC will add it. Maybe you have to go fishing for Leviathan. With an Ifrit-sized fishing pole. But yeah, if there are any Luke Safari's own tips... I'd like them. Uh, hang on. Pokemon. It was eating. It was stationary. He says we'd have to give the haunted Noth all a tiny women want me fish fear me hat. <laughs> um. Okay, so I'm looking at this website called Dragonfly Cave, and they say, um... Uh... Well, this isn't very useful. Uh, balls only is an option. Rocks, then balls. Bait, then balls. But bait will actually reduce the catch rate. Okay. Uh, then rocks to increase catch rate. Bait to get it to stay. Then balls. I guess I can see why someone would be like, screw it, just go with the RNG. Just throw balls until it works. Yeah, safari balls are apparently the equivalent of ultra balls, but, you know, you're throwing it at full health Pokemon with no status effects. Which makes them ass, doesn't it? Yep. Super Rod Stewart. You go sailing in 16 bit. that Team Rocket machine from the Safari Zone episode.
I, I think even, like, the gun nod from that episode, it, like... What, what was it? What, he, he'd seen, like, a Dratini, like, once and took a picture with it or something? And then, like, Team Rocket shows up and sucks up all the Pokémon, and he's like, Oh, hell nah! And then Ash caught 30 Tauros, but then they cut the episode. So Ash just had 30 Tauros for no reason. <laughs> Oh my god, get out of here, Psyduck! Now I know how Misty feels. <laughs> what's, the, what's the appearance rate of a Dratini? I don't know. Not great. <laughs> yeah, evidently. Do you know if, like, the RNG is, like, decided at the start of a fight, or can I, like, use a save state? Um... Hang on. Uh, RNG evolves on a per-frame basis. Hmm. Log. I've been in a safari zone for two months. <laughs> Time hasn't run out because I haven't moved. I packed a lot of lunches. And when I ran out, there was always Psyduck. <laughs> now you might be wondering, <laughs> Rosie, I thought you didn't catch any Psyduck because you wanted to save your balls for Jatini. The thing is, I just hopped into the water and started chomping away. Got a crabby once, chipped a tooth, but you know, you win some or you lose some. Teeth. Get out of here! Hey, come on, we need lunch. Oh my god. I know there's, like, a speedrun category for catching all Pokémon. How does the Safari Zone figure into this, I wonder? Do, do they have to, like, you know, do, like, frame-perfect tricks to, like, manipulate the RNG or something? I have no idea. <laughs> Please, for the love of God! Or Arceus, or whoever. Yes! Okay, uh, um... <laughs> Safe state. Sure. Ball. Well, how about ball? I wonder if there's like a fast load button. I just gotta press F10, I guess. I don't know. Alright, let's, let's try the whole rocks and bait thing. Is 
So the whole thing is just like gambling, right? Where it's like you can throw more rocks, but then it might run? Yeah. Now, um, the bait will also, like, you know, lower the catch rate. But I think throwing a rock doubles it. Okay. Not that, you know, it helps. So, like, would alternating rocks and bait be a good idea, then? Because uh, you'd still get more catch rate out of it? I, I think, like... Uh, or is it, like, as long as it's eating, it's not gonna... No, I think you can throw more, but, like... Or, or like, at what point does it max out? Uh, I don't know, but, like, there's, like, one to five terms where it will stay angry. I could give you the numbers, but the numbers don't mean a damn thing to me, and I'm not sure if they would do you either. And angry means it's more likely to run? I think so. See, none of this means anything to me, and I don't want to just read it verbatim. Is it actually, like, showing a math formula? No, but it's like, the capture chance maxes out when the Pokémon has a catch rate of 150 or more, for which the chance will be about 27 to 30%, depending on rounding errors. All other Pokemon are part of it. I did it. What the hell? I did it without rocks or bait. Okay, whatever. We have Stella. Yeah. The Stella button has been pressed. Long considered a mythical Pokemon until recently, just now, when Red Z catched, caught one. Catched? Alright, so I, I, th I think the plan is to, like, give it a fire move, and I was considering rest just because that's, like, something Stella- that, that, like, works with what Stella has, mm -hmm. but I'm not actually sure that's, like, a good, like, strategic ability for it to have. I'm gonna get the hell out of here and feed you. You just go to a cave to catch that. Ball. I found TM40, whatever that is. I found protein. For items, god damn it. Tossed a bicycle. <laughs> <laughs> Screw this bike! <laughs> okay, we need that. And then, uh. This way to the secret house. know what some of this stuff is for, like the protein and the iron is just like stat boosts. I'm gonna need to throw something out for that HM. Uh, protein? <laughs> sure, yeah. Get rid of it. Uh, I don't know what this 
item is TM. And I need to toss one more thing, so I'll toss the iron. You're the first person to reach the secret house. I was getting worried that no one would win our campaign prize. Congratulations, you've won. Call Ardwolf. <laughs> call, call Ardwolf, say Apogee. <laughs> Do we have anything else we need in here? I don't think so. Huh. Well, take that, Safari Zone. We beat you. I mean, I, I, I mean, if there's like a really specific Pokemon or something. I just walk around in some grass, see if anything happens. Yeah, let's let's catch thirty uh the uh, thirty of those thingies. Yeah, those thingies. Yep. You know them. You know the ones. Pig. Sure. I got a neat arena. What do I call it? Um. Well, it's it's a normal ass Pokemon. Nina. 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 <laughs> Nina to Nidorina. Yeah. Sure. Unless Chat's got something, but if if we catch a Nidorino, um, we will have to name it Co. Co and Nina, the most normal, basic bitch couple. Sure. That's good to meet. Nina. What is with all these, like, painfully normal-ass Pokémon coming at me right now? Really didn't want to catch a Ko? Well, that was just a Nidoran. It wasn't even a Nidorino. Uh. It's Rhyhorn. Also potentially Bochi. name this one Bochi because it won't stay a rock if we like you know train it up and evolve it. Wait I thought Rhyhorn was the evolved one. No. It's not? No. Oh. I don't know. Um hmm. Well yeah we gotta nickname it. Um. <coughs> hmm. What, 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 you, what does chat think? Trying to think, is there a Pokemon girl we can name it after? Oh, what's the name of the Hoenn Earth type or ground type or whatever? Is it Roxanne? Uh, yeah. We we could just name it after her and get real meta. Yeah, but then you say it wasn't going to be a rock anymore. Well, yeah, but it'll still be like you know a ground type, I think. Okay. Eve wanted, Eve wanted a Psyduck to be Bochi. Alright, uh, if we get a Psyduck, it'll be Bochi. Uh, is Psyduck, like, an exclusive to the Safari Zone, or...? Mm, I've got no idea. You have the book. <laughs> Do we want an Execute? Who, who would we name? Uh... Who would we name it after? Do we have an Egg Girl? It's your girl who's an egg. I seem to recall there's like some slice of life for Yuri show where a girl has like a hair ornament that looks like an egg. I. It's in Monogatari, isn't it? Oh yeah, isn't, isn't it... it the uh, the homunculus girl? Hang on. It's Kihi. My other thought is I can't remember which series it is, but there is a Super Sentai where one of the villains is egg-themed. No. Oh. That's a key for us. Oh. It's over! No Platinum Disco here.
That was an adventure. Shibi dooby 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 doo. So we're gonna get Stella in the party to train her up. Yes. Maybe that should be off stream. Yeah, I'm just, you know, trying to decide, like, who are we gonna take out of the party? Right. First, I'm gonna deposit some items, though. We'll be using the rod. We can get the Poke Flute back when we need it for the other Snorlax. We'll get this rod. Southeast corner of the city to get HM4. Alright, who's going on vacation? Hmm. Armika? Yeah, I suppose she could take a break. She's really carrying the team, so. Got Stella. And all was well. Can't wait for EXP share to exist. Um, of course we can fight Koga here, right? Yeah. Or his do like lineup is. Let's take a look. 37, 39, 37, 43. We may need to grind a little. Oh yeah. Hmm. They're all like freaking poison, so I don't what's what what's poison weak against? Ground and psychic. Okay, um... Maybe we do need the rod on. <laughs> we could bring Diglett back. Oh yeah, yeah, no, we could just use Diglett. Toph. Yeah, we could get Toph. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll, I guess I'll pick up Toph right now, then. Uh, she's probably a little behind now, so... And then we'll, um... What's not good against poison? Um, grass. Uh, well, I would I would box Kinoko, but they know cut, <laughs> so <laughs> kind of screwed myself there. Okay, well, maybe Stella's just gonna have to wait. Yeah. Because there's no sense in trying to train multiple Pokemon at the same time if you're just trying to get levels for a specific goal. Gotta find that warden and get strength. I 
I don't remember where we need strength in this game, but it's probably an annoying block pushing puzzle or something. So that's usually how that goes, isn't it? Hmm? Strength? Um. What about it? Sorry, I was. Usually, out. like, you use that for, like, annoying. Uh. Like, block pushing puzzles. Yeah. I found it was always, like, a decent move itself, though. Just, you know, punch good. Hit good. Well, we just got rid of Armika, so... <laughs> The HMs are really starting to, like, encroach on my style here. Wow. Um, shoot. Well, it, it does seem like, you know, right now, grinding is the thing to do. <laughs> yeah. So, maybe we should call it a little early, then? Yeah, maybe. Because I don't know, like, what else I would be doing right now that would be, like, interesting to look at. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Well, you know... Yeah. You know, streaming longer is fun because you get to hang out with stream friends. Yeah. But also, you know, if, if you're, there's not much there, then it's like, hey, a shorter YouTube video is probably also nice. Yeah, I mean, I'm pretty, we've streamed long enough to hit, like, the good algorithm length. Ugh. I hate the algorithm. Yeah, but I still feel like I need more highlights and stuff for people even want to watch my long videos. So. Yeah. Gotta work on that. Well, thank you all very much for watching. Yeah. I love you all. Don't forget to tell all your friends about Rosie. Uh, and, um, you know, follow me on these things down here. Uh, I guess, you know, do like and comment and all that on the YouTube videos, because that probably pushes it further. And I, you know, don't like having to play that game, but I do like having more people who know that Rosie is a thing and should be watched. So... If you would like to help, please do that. Um, please also, like, make clips. If anything cool happens that you're like, yes, people should know about this. Become part of the Rosie Corps, the Rosie Squad. We will all Rosie. Rosie rolling out! Bye. I don't know why I did the creepy, scary voice. Menacing dog. Oh, spooky. <laughs> I was going to do the Judge Doom voice, but I think it would clip the microphone. <laughs> I am Ghost. Gus, 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 gus. Ness, ness, ness.